First of all, they were called just around four o'clock in the morning to Ilkson Road, to the west of the city centre, where they say they found two people dead in the street. They were then called about a mile to the east, to Milton Street, where they say a driver had attempted to run over three people. Those three people, we understand, are in hospital. And then at some point, it's not clear exactly when, but a man was found dead on Magdala Road, again, about a mile or so to the north. Now, we also understand that the 31-year-old man was arrested here on Bentink Road, uh, and you can see a picture now of the van that police have recovered, which appears to have some significant damage to the windscreen, and forensics officers are currently combing through the area. Now, if we just pull back out onto the map, I want to give you a sense of the scale of the police operation. We've plotted all of the streets and the roads that police closed at some point throughout the morning. And you can see there the shaded area. In all, very roughly, it's about a square mile of the centre of Nottingham. Now, not all of that was closed, clearly, but if we pinch in slightly on the city centre, you can see there uh, Maid Marion Way, a major dual carriageway is the white box to the left. To the right is uh, Milton Street, where the van ran over three people. And this is a picture of Milton Street. And you can see this is a, a major thoroughfare uh, full of shops and bus lanes and the like that was essentially locked down for several hours uh, through most of the morning this morning, essentially during rush hour uh, on a busy Tuesday morning.